The Grumman XF-5F Skyrocket was one of the most distinctive and technically ambitious naval fighters of its era. Developed by the Grumman Aircraft Engineering Corporation, the project began in response to a 1938 United States Navy specification SD-12-14, which called for a carrier-based fighter with exceptional climb rate, short takeoff distance, and powerful armament. Grumman's design, internally designated G-34, stood out immediately for its radical configuration. A twin-engine layout with the nose of the fuselage starting behind the wing's leading edge, giving it an unusually compact and recognizable silhouette. The prototype, ordered on the 30th of June 1938 and designated xf 5 f one used two 1,200 horsepower Wright R1A20-40-42 Cyclone radial engines with counter-rotating propellers to eliminate torque effects. The aircraft had a folding low wing, fully retractable landing gear, and H-shaped tail. The initial armament plan called for two 20mm Madsen cannons and two 12.7mm machine guns, though the prototype flew unarmed. Construction began in late 1939, and the first flight took place on the 1st of April 1940, piloted by Grumman test pilot Robert Gill. Flight tests revealed impressive climb performance, over 1,200 meters per minute, approximately 3,937 feet per minute, and good handling with one engine inoperative. Forward visibility was excellent thanks to the short nose, and the counter-rotating propellers virtually eliminated takeoff swing. However, the aircraft suffered from oil cooling issues, high control forces on the elevator, and limited longitudinal stability. Modifications followed, a lower canopy, redesigned nacelles with spinners, an extended nose, and a revised four-gun battery. By mid-1941, the updated XF-5F1 reached speeds over 610 km per hour, approximately 379 miles per hour, but still fell short of Navy expectations. In competitive trials, the Skyrocket faced rivals such as the Vought's F4U Corsair and the Grumman F4F Wildcat. Despite excellent climb and handling, the Navy chose the simpler single-engine Wildcat for production due to logistical and maintenance concerns. The XF-5F remained a one-off prototype, but continued as a valuable flying laboratory, influencing the design of Grumman's later twin-engine XF-7F Tiger Cat. The Skyrocket flew until December 11, 1944, when a landing gear failure led to a belly landing that ended its operational life. The airframe was later used to train ground crews in pilot rescue techniques. Though never produced in numbers, the XF-5F Skyrocket marked a turning point for carrier aviation. It demonstrated the potential of twin-engine fighters and embodied Grumman's innovative approach to naval aircraft design. Its futuristic look even inspired the comic book aircraft of the Black Hawk series, ensuring its place in both aviation and popular culture history.